wire beating of the playoffs, largely due to Aaron Brooks. It was a loss where Lamar Odom suffered a bruised lower back, so Andrew Bynum starting game five in his place with the series tied at two games apiece. And Bynum has not played well in the playoffs this year, but he really picked it up in this one, 14 points and six rebounds. Ron Artest pretty much always playing pretty well for the Rockets. Shane Battier, three up, three down. He outscored Kobe 15 to 23 in game four, keeping it going in this one. But the Lakers would turn it up to a new level starting in the first quarter. Trevor Reza with the big finish there. Tied the game at 18 off from there. It was all Lakers. Kobe Bryant, 12 points in the opening quarter. Late in the first, Jordan Farmer is going to drive. Hit the deep three. Unbelievable to end the quarter. Lakers up 11 after one and would start the second quarter on an 8-0 run. Lamar Odom in the game being effective despite being injured. He had 10 points in 19 minutes. Then things started to get out of hand. Pau Gasol for the tough lay-in, 16 points, 13 rebounds for him. Then it's Kobe. 20 of his 26 points came in the first half. Lakers led by 25 at the break. Third quarter, Aaron Brooks coming off that big 34-point game. Uh, not so much. 14 in this one, 411 shooting. Lewis Scholas, he's going to miss. Then it's Brian Cook from the wing. Uh, uh, not going to happen. 5 for 29 from 3 were the Rockets. They shot 32% from the field for the game. And you remember, game 4, Houston led by 30 after 3. Lakers up 40 after 3. Talk about sending a message. How the tables turn in this league. L.A. just hands a beat down. 118 to 